Ernie here. It is Friday morning, which also means it is my meal prep day. Uh, so not a lot of prepping, just my normal, usual things. Uh, I'm going to throw a package of brats, their cheddar brats, in the air fryer. I've got a couple of cheddar brat burgers that I'm going to throw in the air fryer. I'm going to shred some cheese to make chaffles. And I think uh, I'm going to make a trip to Schnucks. Uh, I need to get some bleach and uh, because I didn't get a big package of pepper jack cheese from Gordon yesterday, I'm going to get a smaller package today at Schnucks. And I think I'm also going to get uh, some Swiss cheese. The big Swiss cheese, I, I get that for my dad, and then I just get a smaller one for myself. Um, <clears throat> So, oh, and I also want to get some frozen onions because I ran out of those. I do have an onion here. I just, I hate chopping onions. Hate it. So, got uh, my second load of laundry going. I'm getting ready to go upstairs. I'm probably going to break my fast soon. Um, it is a quarter after seven and I'm, I'm getting hungry. Uh, I'm thinking uh, I might just, I don't know yet, have some coffee with cream in it. I don't know. <laughs> uh, I was watching a while back uh, Two Fit Docs and uh, I think it was Becky Gillespie was saying that cream would ordinarily break a fast but if you're trying to extend your fast to make it longer then by all means do the cream. I don't know yet. I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> I'm probably just going to go ahead and break it. So it'll be 16 hours. I ate. The last time I ate was 3.30 yesterday. So I'll probably just go ahead and, and break it at 7.30. So, all right. I'm going to get dressed and get the day going. So I hope everyone has a great day. I'll see you later. Hey there. So, I am done pretty much with most of my stuff for the day. Uh, I got all my cooking stuff done. I shredded that big block of mozzarella that I got from Gordon yesterday. I cooked a package of uh, brats, four of them, and I had one of them for breakfast. I waited until 9.30 before I had any creamer or anything so I could say that I did 18 hours. So my fast was 18 hours. Uh, so. I had that, plus I had uh, the uh, oh, the keto custard that Wendy makes at uh, Mama Does Keto. So I, I made one batch of that, but I put it in uh, microwavable muffin cups, and there was, ended up being a total of 12 of them, and I had six of them for breakfast. I used the uh, Premier Cinnamon Roll flavor. For mine so six of those plus the brats or one brat just one is what I had for breakfast and one chaffle gosh I keep adding stuff <laughs> that's it that's what I had <laughs> so the the six little muffin things ended up being basically half of a premier protein and one and a half eggs uh, so got that I made the two brat burgers cheddar burgers so those will be for the weekend. Uh, I got my pulled pork down from the freezer for the weekend. I've got ham for the weekend. I just went to Walgreens, picked up my prescription. And while I was there, see, I ordinarily, when I am there, get two of the Blueberry Crumble Quest Hero Bars. But they did not have any. And they're usually two for five dollars. Uh, so instead, I got these uh, Quest cookies. I've never had the Quest cookies before. So I got three of them. They were three for five dollars. The chocolate chip. They, that's the only one they had. The only only kind they had. So I got three of them. Uh, so, on to my post office. I went to pick up my package that I ordered from Amazon. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much to Aretha from Seattle Sapphire's Low Carb World, uh, I would not have been able to have placed this order if not for her. So I thank you very, very, very much, Aretha. Uh, but I wanted to order some more 
Okay, backstory. <laughs> uh, Aretha had sent me a uh, box. It was full of samples from KetoCon. And in the box was one single serving of Keto Chow, and it was the chocolate flavor. And I just had it a few days ago, finally. And I, because I had forgotten I had it, and I absolutely loved it. Loved, loved, loved it. And it filled me up. So I decided I wanted to order more. And I, I know this stuff is like super duper expensive, but I really want some. So I thought I would just go with some, you know, a sample pack. And I wanted the blender bottle. Uh, and I, I was getting ready to place my order. I was going to place my order when I got home from the post office the other day. From sending off my giveaway package not realizing that was going to cost $72 to send <laughs> there went my Amazon order <laughs> well thank you to Aretha I was able to order this so and I got some allulose too I've never had allulose and I've been wanting to try to keep seeing it in recipes so I finally got that so here's my bag of allulose so happy to have that that's dense that's really heavy Wow. So, allulose, and then these, one of the sample packs of the Keto Chow, the starter bundle. So, in it is the blender bottle. Okay. Alright, there's my little blender thingy. <laughs> I actually have one of these inside uh, one of my whisks upstairs so that's what I was using I just took it out of my whisk and put it in the bottle so here's my little blender bottle okay and then also with this sample pack let's see we've got vanilla the good thing about vanilla is you can always add other flavors to it to make it your own. Mocha. Snickerdoodle, which is my very favorite cookie flavor. So I am excited about trying that. Strawberry. Another one I am excited about trying. Chocolate, which I know I already like since I've already had it. And another one I'm super excited about trying because another one of my favorite flavors, salted caramel. And then I also got, I was it was supposed to be four packs, but one of them's not going to be here until next week sometime. Uh, I got the uh, pumpkin spice caramel. Yum. Banana, and I know some of these are seasonal, but I don't care. I like them all season. I mean, you know, I like, as far as, like, food stuff, all season long, all year long is fine with me. So, eggnog. I know, Christmassy, I don't care. I like eggnog any time of year. <laughs> Alright, so that is all of my keto chow sample packs and I am super excited I probably won't try any of them today uh, but sometime throughout the weekend maybe I don't know might wait all, wait until next week but anyway I am super excited about that okay that is gonna do it for now I'll we'll try and get these back in here <laughs> all right Okay, so I'm getting ready to go back upstairs. Uh, actually, I think I want to put my laundry away first. Uh, yeah, I got I did two loads of laundry. Just got to put it all away now. And then I'm going to sit and relax for a while. I'm probably going to go outside. Uh, it is 43 degrees out, the, out there, but it feels warmer to me. Probably because I got this cozy, squishy, heavy sweater on. <laughs> but anyway... I will check back in a little bit. I hope everyone's having a great day. Okay, so here is going to be my lunch. Cracked black pepper tuna infusions. 
with one of these. I've not ever tried those. Fizzy water and watching the Keto Twins. All right, so I forgot to record my dinner and that was the normal Portofino yellowfin tuna. And I just put some Kobe Jack cheese and lemon juice in it and my seasoning. So here is my snack. I've got a little bit of the chiote that I cooked a few days ago. Got a little bit of uh, syrup on there. And then I'd say about an eighth of a cup to a fourth of a cup of this keto snack mix that I got from Costco. This is, uh, these are like cheese balls. Very good. And then I've got a mango limeade puller. So that's my snack. Hey there. So I am closing today out and for the weekend. I won't be doing any recording over the weekend. Um, probably not going to be doing any fasting over the weekend either. Um, so I'll start it back up Sunday afternoon, 3.30. Um, <clears throat> So I guess that's it. I don't have anything to show right now. Um, I am working on a couple of whips, but I'll wait until next week. I actually ran out of yarn for one of them today. Figures. <laughs> Alright, so I hope everyone has a great weekend. If you could give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, I would really appreciate that. And I'll see you next week.